Welcome to Puerto Vallarta, y'all. This is Los Muertos Beach on the Bay of Banderas in Puerto Vallarta, Mexico. This is where I am spending my day in a beach chair, in this water, right here. I'm gonna eat, I'm gonna drink, and I'm gonna be happy all day long. Y'all, this is truly paradise. If you ask me anywhere in the world that I wanna go, it is right here. And we are here for the next two weeks. Los Muertos Beach is super busy, especially this time of year. It's January. It's high season. Everybody is in Puerto Vallarta because of the beautiful weather. It is 85 and sunny pretty much every single day here. It, you just cannot beat this. And I'm ready to spend the day on my beach chair. And we have just ordered lunch. We've already had, I think, two rounds of drinks. Brandy is two Bloody Marys in at this point, and I've had a mimosa. So this is La Palapa Beach Club behind me. We're getting settled in because lunch is on the way. Oh, he brought the Bloody Mary. We're, this is Bloody Mary number two and it's like 11.30 in the morning. Cold? It's cool. You'll be all right, have another Bloody Mary. I bought a beach bag from the lovely lady on the beach. I don't buy much from beach vendors, but every year I do get a super cute beach bag. And I could not pass this up. Look how adorable this is. And her sister hand make these bags and they make the pom-poms. Look at that. I love the pom-poms at the farmer's market, which y'all see we're going to tomorrow. I always buy a pom-pom and I put it on my purse that I carry at home. But I've never seen these little, I've never seen the little lady pom-poms and they are adorable. So I'm going to call her Senorita and this is my new beach bag. That's kind of pretty. So I live for this cranberry mojito. I can like just, the taste of this stays with me all year long. Just got my first one. It has been a beautiful day on the beach at La Palapa. We have had, let's see, I got banana bread from the Muffin Man. We had chips from the guy with some kind of hot sauce and lime on them. I don't even know what I said yes to. It was super hot. I bought a beach bag with the cutest little, can you see it right here? The cutest little pom-pom girl in there and I don't know, just a lot. We have had a good day. I can feel the relaxation setting in and it's a good feeling, y'all. So this is Hola. Miguel. This is Miguel. He's our guy at La Palapa. He treats us well. Thank you so much. Appreciate it. Thank you. We, we love it here. Tomorrow again? Uh, we're going to the farmer's market tomorrow. Okay. So, Sunday. Sunday? Sunday will be back. Hey there! It is Saturday morning, y'all, and this is one of my absolute most favorite, favorite, favorite things that we do while we're in Puerto Vallarta, and we're going to, can you see it? The Farmer's Market. Y'all, this is one of the coolest farmer's markets I have ever seen. And it is so, like everything is local. It is an artisan market, all the fresh food, the produce. I mean, I, mean, I, don't, I can't even explain it. I don't even have words. The, there are cigars, there are bags, there is artwork, there's jewelry, there's all kinds of fresh food. Music, as you can hear, it is an unbelievable market. And they only have it from like November to April, I think, on Saturdays. So we are headed into the market. I bring a mesh shopping bag with me just so that I can carry all the things that I get at the market. I love this market. So if you're ever in Puerto Vallarta during the winter months, make sure you check out the Olas Altas Farmer's Market on Saturday mornings.
I think we got that one last time, didn't we? Did you? <laughs> Here we go. Oh, here's my caramel chili. back from the market we are steamy when we left the house this morning it was kind of overcast so i didn't take any sunglasses randy actually wore a long sleeve shirt and i told him he was gonna regret it and he's regretting it we are hot the sun is out and we just took the long walk back home so let me show you what we got uh, we got some homemade sourdough bread that is filled with cheese we got a flan. This is a peanut butter flan covered in chocolate, and I need to get it, this in the fridge because it got melty. 
We got two empanadas. I got a blackberry one and Randy got a chorizo and queso. I have two baklava. They're pecan baklava. Y'all, this is the best, oh my gosh, stuff. Homemade tortilla chips, roasted tomatilla salsa, and garlic hummus. I got a jar of honey. And then we got roasted almonds that are covered in sesame seeds. And then Randy got sauces from his favorite lady. This is the, I don't know how you say it, Pequeen hot sauce. This stuff, oh my gosh, I cannot even put a dab on my food. I can't do it. But the chili caramel sauce, I love this stuff. I will use it on my chicken. Um, when we grill at home, it's so good. So we got our favorite sauces. And then I got my beach cover up. I'll really show you this, but this is my little beach cover up. So this is our haul from the farmer's market. Good morning again from Puerto Vallarta. It is a beautiful morning. I got up at 6.30. I've been outside watching the sun come up. Beautiful, sunny beach day. And that is exactly where we're headed, is to the beach. But it's about 8.30 in the morning right now. We are doing something. We get like those really nice Tommy Bahama beach chairs. And on days, because we're here for two weeks, y'all, I don't want to pay um, to rent beach chairs every day that I'm here. That's that's a little too much for me, even though I love Lapa Lapa. But we get at Sam's two of the like Tommy Bahama beach chairs and we can go down and actually sit right in front of Lapa Lapa or by the pier or wherever we want to sit. And the trick is we are members of a um, Puerto Vallarta Facebook group and so at the end of the week we will post pictures of our chairs on there for sale and we will sell our chairs so it really doesn't cost us anything to go buy these chairs I've never tried to bring them down as part of our luggage that just seems like well, a big stinking hassle when I can buy them for $35 and sell them for 30 and I used them all week long so that is what we do so we're taking an uber we're gonna run to Sam's and uh, get our beach chairs and be back in plenty of time for beach day. But Randy's in the shower. I'm ready. Look, sporting shirt, y'all. Like, I had to do it right. I had to. Okay. <gasps> All right, y'all, we are in Sam's. We are getting our secret beach chairs. And because we're here for two weeks, we come to Sam's, we get these little really nice beach chairs and we put them on Facebook and we sell them when we leave and we basically get our money back. So, little travel tip. Look how excited he is <laughs> to have the beach chairs. We're gonna get water and toilet paper because our condo has scented toilet paper. No, that doesn't work for me. So, this is what happens when you go anywhere with Randy. We had a plan. Chairs, toilet paper, water, get out. No. Now you can see we have two bags of chips in our, in our bag and he's headed off to try to find the Corona. We have the Uber driver waiting outside. This is supposed to be a super quick trip, Sam's and back, because I wanna go to the beach. It is a beautiful day. The sun is out and it is calling my name. But no, we're in Sam's. Look at these cool swim trunks. You only find that in Mexico. I pretty need to get some of these with the limes or lemons on them. Look, are these avocado? Avocados on swim trunks. Limes. He's coming back empty-handed. They don't have light. Oh, they got the regular. Oh my God. Did you see the <laughs> lemons avocados on your swim trunks? Aww. But they're short. I thought they were gonna cool though. But they're $20, right? We 
Would you wear those? I just thought they're cute. Yeah, I wear them here. You wear them here. Well, I mean, I wear you them, wear them here. here. These are medium. I guess we're getting some avocado beach trunks. We'll get some. We'll get some. Hey, that's a... <laughs> okay. Let's get out of here. Let's get out of here. Out to the beach. You want pity bear? No. <laughs> we made it to the beach. The Clampets have made it to the beach. Like, oh my gosh. Y'all know like the Beverly Hillbilly show from, I used to watch it when I was growing up. The Beverly Hillbillies, you know, the Clampets. That is what we feel like when we're trucking down to the beach with our beach chairs from Sam's and our cooler and our snacks. But that's how we roll someday. So we're all settled in and the beach is crowded. But there's an area on the beach where all of the Canadians and Americans that are here kind of long term or for the winter they all come down with their beach chairs and kind of sit together on the beach and so that's where we're hanging let me see up there he has his avocado shorts on that he got at sam's which i think is absolutely hilarious we're just gonna hang at the beach today you can see the pier behind me the beach is super crowded let me just do a little a little pan we're just gonna hang out and uh, enjoy our sunshine Super cute little beach cover up that I got from <laughs> the farmer's market yesterday. Randy is in his avocado shorts. I mean, we think they're avocados. We really don't know what they are, but we're just chilling. Look, we got a cooler. I got my bag. We got beer. We got we got beer. We got water. We got Doritos. We've got music and books and our beach chairs, and we are super super comfy. We're just gonna chill here for the day. Ooh, much easier way home. Somewhat. Well, somewhat. I mean, we still got a hill, but we don't have to take all those stairs. We're just kind of on a stop cobblestone street. You can see it behind us. Ooh, but it was a beautiful, beautiful day on the beach. We were out there from like 12.30 to 4.30. <sighs> we're going to head up. We're going to make a cocktail. We're going to go up to the rooftop pool. Get showered and go out to dinner. <laughs> So we went to Jorge's Hideaway and Shrimp Shack tonight. And we met some friends on the beach today that told us about Jorge's. So we headed here for dinner. I had coconut shrimp with a fresh mango sauce, mashed potatoes, and sauteed vegetables. And Randy had a spicy shrimp. So we enjoyed our meal. So we're tired, guys. We're gonna head back. We've had a big day at the beach. We have our food tour tomorrow with Vallarta Eats, and we have to be up, dressed, and ready to go, and ready to eat at 10 a.m. So we're heading back to the condo. So I will see you all tomorrow, bright and early when the sun comes up. <laughs>